Well, good morning, friends. Carrie from Texas. All right, we're talking about number eight. Again. This one is just beyond even... It's beyond even comprehension that the left is okay with this. Considering what has happened in this country from terrorists and what they did to this nation and the fact that they were let in here and to consider now that there's more terrorists here because this administration doesn't know where any of them are because they just simply walk across the border. There are terrorists in our, in our nation right now because of the failed border policy, Vice President Harris. Now, we're all Americans. We all are passionate about our country, obviously, or we wouldn't be in this horrific fight that we're in. But if we're all Americans, how can it be for any American to allow and think it's okay to continually let terrorists in our nation through our southern border? And the, the administration have no clue where they are. How is that okay? How can that be okay? How do we know that we're not facing another horrific act from terrorists? We don't. We're on the highest terrorist alert that we have ever been since post 9-11. And that is a direct result of this vice president's failed policies. It is. You can spin it any way you want you can dress it up with a bow and pretty little feathers and all the rest of it, but you cannot wash this away. Her failed pathetic efforts at the southern border have allowed terrorists in this nation who are here now, and we all know what they're here for. It's nothing good. This is your failed policy administration, Vice President Harris. You cannot walk away from it. You cannot use the media to spin it and say, oh, I wasn't the czar. I don't care if you were the czar or not. You were in charge, honey. You have specifically said that you were gonna go get to the bottom of it. Well, did you know? Are you allowing terrorists to walk across that border every day? Yes. Did you see over the weekend how many people walked across the southern border? They're all in a panic now. And more are coming every day because they know what's happening in November. How can you sleep at night knowing that you have failed miserably and that there are terrorists in our nation right now? It'll just be another example if it happens, God forbid, that you have more blood on your hands. You already have 13 servicemen and women who died in Afghanistan that, oh, you and Joe say you don't have any soldiers that have died on your watch? Another lie. Another lie. I don't know how you can sleep at night. I don't know how any American can think this is okay. Yes, we're all humans. I get all of that. But if you're gonna come here, come here legally and do it the right way and then have all of the wonderful benefits of coming here. You don't just get to circumvent the legal process like millions of us have gone through, including myself. You don't get to do that just because this is a lazy, inept, pathetic excuse for administration and that's what it is. How many terrorists are here right now because you have allowed them to walk over the border? And we'll probably never know that answer to that question because you don't have any idea how many there are or where they are or how to track them. Pathetic. American lives are on the line and you continue to just giggle and try to pass the buck. It's a pretty good example of what we could expect if you were elected as president of this land, which we can't afford. Americans die because of this. 
they're on their their deaths are on your head from your failed policy on the border of allowing terrorists and anybody else to walk across that border and not have a clue who they are or why they're here. I would like you to explain it to me and my family. We did it legally. How is it okay? It's not. And there's no excuse. Doesn't matter what you say or how you spin it. It is a failed, failed policy. How do you feel about America? Terrorists in our land again. Surely you can see right or left that this is inexcusable because it puts you and me at risk. Number eight, Harris's failed administration policy on the border allowing terrorists into our land. God bless the United States of America.